how to fix Fortnite out of video memory after the new update. So recently after the new update of Fortnite OG, many people are finding this issue of getting a video out of memory error message. So it's a very simple way to fix this. What you have to do is first and foremost in the search bar you have to type device manager. Once device manager opens, inside here what you're going to find is you're going to find something called as display drivers. So to click on this small little icon over here to triangle one. I'm expecting it that you have a graphics card which is present on your computer or your laptop. So I have a 1660 Ti and my internal graphic card is a HD graphics 630 so i don't want my game to be running on this one so i want it to be running on the 1660 ti so what you do is you right click on the inbuilt graphics processor which is present there and simply click on disable device and simply click on yes what this will do is it will force the game to run it on your dedicated graphic card which you have then you will not find this issue so that's the first step which you have to do second thing what you have to do is you have to open epic games launcher once your epic games launcher loads you have to go to your library and you have to find fortnite i have not updated fortnite on this computer because i don't play it here i play in a different computer but what do you have to do is you have to click on this three simple dots over here first thing you have to click on manage once you go to manage you'll find a space over here where you have to type this command which is d3 d11 make sure you put a small minus sign on front of it and once you have typed this since you have already updated you will find an option over here where somewhere it will be set as verify you have to click on that it will re-download if something is corrupted won't be that of a big size so you can simply click on verify it will simply verify all the files and once you have done that you can try the game see if you're getting the issue next thing what you can do is whether you're an nvidia or an amd user make sure to download the latest graphics drivers for this what you have to do is you have to open any of your browser and over there for nvidia users you have to type nvidia drivers you have to click on the very first link which is the nvidia drivers download over here simply click on it once this opens you have to fill which graphic card you're currently having so you're going to choose whichever graphic card for example i'm having a laptop with 1660 ti so i'm going to choose 16 series notebook and as you can see it has chosen 1660 ti windows 10 and i need a game ready driver simply search for it so once i search it it will search for automatically it will search for the latest driver as you can see this is the latest one which has been released on 31st of october and this is the size of it simply click on download it will automatically download install it then try the game i'm pretty sure your problem will be fixed for amd users you can simply type in amd drivers and you're going to find this particular link over here which is amd drivers and support so over here also it's the same thing as like the nvidia one you just have to choose your graphic card which you're currently having and simply submit it it will search the latest drivers simply download it install it then try your game it will work perfectly fine so these are the three Three steps which you can do in order to fix this problem if you're still having the issue or, you, or if you're getting some other bugs you can put that in the comment section or you can refer to my twitter put a screenshot tag me over there and if this video was a little bit informative please don't forget the like button consider subscribing my channel hitting the bell icon if you're new here i'll see you in the next video thank you so much for watching bye, -bye.